What's up guys, it's Nicholas, aka The New Ninja here, and uh, I'm sure you know what day it is. At least I hope so. It's Monday mashup time. Alright, forgive me if I seem like I'm getting kind of short with these topics. This is the third time I've recorded this video. First time I was out of focus, um, because I had the camera set up a different way. I'm just going to shoot Monday mashups like this from now on, because these are the videos that I do by myself. Second time, the wife came home mid-shoot, and I was like, well, I'll just restart it. I was getting long-winded anyways. And then I just realized that this whole time I did a really good shot. I was like five minutes in, and my mic was not on. So, that was fun. Whatever. It's, it's whatever. Um, I want to start off today by saying I enjoy doing live streams for you guys, and I'm sure you guys have noticed I've been doing of quite a few of them. Uh, it, it gives me a nice chunk of content to fill in with on like Wednesday or Tuesday or maybe even Thursday and it gives me something to put in that slot without having to work on editing a video it's just uh, off the cuff I can get just get on uh, turn on the camera and that's it um, but the problem with that is is that my upload and I'm sure you guys have seen in the replays uh, I'll do a test stream first and it looks good uploads doing good or else I just don't even attempt it um, and then I'll get on and I'll watch the replay and like half an hour in, it gets really blocky, it gets really pixelated. And it's because my upload speed is 4, 4 up and 60 down. And that is all that Charter offers in my area as far as I know. I've talked to them, they haven't told me anything else. Um, but it's good when it's consistent. The problem with it is, is that when that, when that 4 is fluctuating, <clears throat> and sometimes it is higher, but when that 4 is fluctuating, it, it doesn't... It doesn't help keep a good live stream going. Um, and so I'm looking at what I can do to mitigate that, kind of get it back up to more consistent levels, um, and hopefully be able to do more live streams for you guys. Because like I said, I really enjoy doing them. So second, let's talk about tech. Um, obviously, Titan XP. The new Titan XP, not the old XP, which everyone was calling Titan XP, but it wasn't Titan XP. It was just the Titan X, Pascal. It's just, just forget about it. Um, I feel like you guys have heard about this just because of, I feel terrible for any Titan owner right now because they have officially gotten kicked in the face twice. Um, when you buy a graphics card, at least in my opinion, I expect to be able to keep it as the most relevant card for about a year, or at least the most relevant card in that bracket, I should say. Um, but you, you, when you buy a card, you hope for a year. I mean, you had the 1080 Ti come out about a month ago. And that just that was just as fast as the Titan X Pascal. Um, and that kind of was a kick to the face to Titan owners, which I felt bad for. But, it, I mean, I kind of expected it to be pretty close in performance if they came out with the TI. For them to then re-release the Titan X as the Titan XP with more CUDA cores, um, and it is faster for the same price as the original Titan X Pascal. Uh, I just, I don't see what their business plan is here. Obviously, make money, but I'm not seeing, you're screwing over your top-end customers. I just, I'm not seeing where you're going with this. Um, and plus, it's going to be really weird, because now when you release, what are they going to do when, in a couple months, hopefully, in like June, the 11 series, or whatever series they're going to come out with, comes out, what do you do at that point? Are you just like, okay, well another titan i mean how many times are people that and i mean if you're buying titans i feel like 90 percent of people probably aren't worried about money at that point but how how many times are you going to rebrand the titan in one year i mean this will be if you're going to do another titan that'll be a second titan in one year uh, i just i'm not seeing where this is going um but that's why i'm not a businessman i guess to, just to recap, I don't know where NVIDIA is going with this, um, but I do feel bad for Titan owners. Uh, hopefully, hopefully you didn't buy the card recently. Anyways, on to what I'm working on this week. I'm looking at working on, I'm sure you guys saw the picture on Instagram of the Asus Sabertooth Mark I from my old build. Um, that's going in the Wife's Project Lotus. Uh, it's a white and purple build, as I'm sure you know. Um, and I'm looking at doing actually a custom paint job on the thermal armor on that so it's white. 
She doesn't know about it yet. She said, no, the, the, the black is fine. I was like, no. I was like, yeah, okay, uh-huh. And as soon as she was gone, I was like, yeah, I'm definitely pulling the thermal arm, armor off, and I'm going to give that a nice coat of white. So it'll look good in there. Um, and I'll definitely show you guys pictures of that. Uh, I'm also going to work on getting the upgrade to Orion up, uh, all edited. It's going to be a lot of work just because it is like a montage. It's not just time lapse or anything like that. So I'm going to have to put quite a bit of work into that. And then I'm thinking I'm going to edit down the uh, trip to Great Lakes Crossing Mall and see if I can get a just some bonus content out of that. There's not a lot of tech in it, though, and that's why I'm kind of hesitant to upload it. Um, we did go to, like, the Lego store there, and that was cool, and I got shots of all, like, the Lego creations and all that. Um, but let me, I mean, if you guys want to see that, let me know. Um, I don't mind editing it. It's not going to be a lot of work. Uh, I'm almost tempted to just make a second channel just for those kind of videos to go up on, but I don't really want to spread. I If I did a second channel, it would be one that I just upload to whenever I have a video for it, not a schedule like this where I'm Monday, Friday, Monday, Friday. I'm, I'm going to try to keep it just random if I do that. And then hopefully not this coming up Friday, but the Friday after that, I will have the 6600K versus 7700K uh, just for gaming. I want to see I want to see how much of a difference it does make in gaming. And I know it's not going to be a lot, but that's not why I got it. So I'm not too worried about that. Um, but yeah, if you guys have any suggestions, let me, uh, let me know down in the comments. Uh, I'm definitely open to suggestions. I will try to work out doing whatever you guys think I should be doing. All right, guys, make sure you hit that subscribe button if you enjoyed the video. Uh, look at the channel. Um, I do have a lot more videos like this, Monday mashups. Um, and, yeah, so leave me a like if you liked the video. Leave me a dislike if you didn't. Like I said, leave me a comment if you have any suggestions or you just want to say hi. And, uh, yeah, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.